All right, people, hit the like button on this video if you need a little bit of privacy from your neighbors. Share this video if you don't want your neighbors peering into your backyard because we are going to talk about how to build a natural privacy wall. All right, you have a few options. You can go with a hedge. Now, hedges are great because they're dense and they're thick. However, it takes time for them to grow, so it's not a very immediate solution. If you've got some neighbor on the other side of this hedge that peering in, always interfering with your business and disturbing your comfort, you're going to want something that grows a little bit faster. This is kind of a good big picture solution because once it's up, I mean, you, you can't see through the thing. It's unpleasant to touch. It's going to really give you a buffer from your neighbors. Now you notice that this hedge is totally on trim and that's very intentional. I want this thing to be as thick as possible so that the lady behind me doesn't disturb what I'm doing here. However, most people, they prefer to have a little bit of a tidy garden, so you can trim it in two ways. If you take something off the front, the bush is going to grow taller, which can be nice to barricade from neighbors that have windows which are above your garden. If you take something off the top, it's going to go thicker. So uh, always keep that in mind. The hedge is a great option. Now, if we move over, you need something more immediate. Now it's the fall, so these uh, this grass is a little bit um, ragged looking, but during the summer months, it stands up and it gives me all the privacy I need. Would you believe that this 10 foot tall grass has grown in just one season? Now, I don't feel there's a need to specify the exact breed of this grass because there are many, many variations, but essentially you could think of it as an aggressive, invasive growing plant that would actually take over your garden if you didn't tend it. You let it grow up and your neighbors will just disappear. They will grow down, if you will. Now, when you prepare for the winter months, it's important to actually leave this grass intact, otherwise the roots can die, and then at the end of the spring, you hack it down grows and fresh it goes right back up so the disadvantage to this is that you have to kind of cut it down every season it produces a lot of waste and it's very invasive the advantage is that it can block your neighbors out of the picture within a matter of months I really like it the other cool thing is that when the wind blows it makes a, a lovely sound now let's say you want a little bit more of an elegant solution and you are in uh, in it for the long haul let's say maybe you get on well with the neighbors who are on the other side of your house you can also put in shrubs trees the obvious advantage to this is once these suckers grow big they're going to be strong resilient to weather they don't need a lot of maintenance you know you just trim them up and they offer a really really nice dividing factor from your neighbors but these which were just planted in the beginning of the summer they've grown well, about that much, I would say, are fragile in the beginning. That's the first issue. The second issue is I'm going to literally have to wait years for these to fill in to the point that my neighbor will disappear. Fortunately, I like the neighbor on this side, but I don't like the neighbor on that side. So, you know, it's all a matter of preference and uh, taste. I have to wait probably another three or four years to let these trees fill in, but once it does, I'm going to be in my own little gardening paradise. Now maybe I overlooked a type of vegetation you can use to build a natural privacy wall. And if I did, please write me in the comment section below. Again, if you're annoyed with your neighbors and you want a privacy wall, share this with your friends. Let's really put the message out there. You know, privacy is good, planting trees is good, so this video needs to be shared. I will see you next time. Subscribe to Great Gardening. Peace.